This is going to be aged feeble. Right? It's Cupid and Psyche. That's right. All right, here we go. Jubal, ready? So, this chapter was about... Well, it's not a chapter. And it's also not a real story. It's a myth. It's a Greek and Roman myth. But it's about Cupid and Psyche. <laughs> and Psyche um, was a woman that everybody loved more than the god Venus. And so they didn't sacrifice to Venus. They all were crowding around Psyche. <laughs> and Venus got mad at Psyche. And so she told her son Cupid to shoot her with an arrow and make it like and make her love something that looked really, really bad. But then Cupid also loved Psyche. So he made Psyche love him. So what? Okay. And so then Psyche went with Cupid to his dwelling. But then Psyche's sis Psyche invited her sisters over, and her sisters were really jealous. And he ha she hadn't saw her husband at all because he was he was making himself invisible to her. So her sisters asked her if, like, told her that, like that, who, like her husband was a like was like a really bad lurking person and so Psyche got curious and if, and so Psyche saw Cupid and then she saw that Cupid was a god and then Cupid ran away and Psyche jumped out the window why'd she jump out the window? She was trying to. She was trying to grab onto Cupid while she, he flew away, but he she didn't, and she fell down out of the castle. Hmm. Then. She was searching everywhere for Cupid. And then she found a place and that had a bunch of corn laying down and she stored all the corn and all the stuff. And then the and then it so happened that that was, that was one of the gods places they lived and the god said to Psyche, if you want your husband back then you, you should please Venus. And so she went to Venus, and Venus made her sort out tons and tons of little tiny grains. Uh huh. But she didn't finish it, and so so like uh, another god helped her out with it, and then Venus made her do another thing, trying to tell her to get for like golden fleece off sheep every single one of her sheep and but then a river god told her that that like they would the sheep would kill her and told her to wait till n noon when they went for their nap and so she did and, and then she got the fleece from them that was tangled up on the bushes Mm -hmm. And then Venus made her do another thing to get a box from Persephone. And uh, another god told her how to get there with, get down to Hades without um, being in danger. And so she got the box and was bringing it back to Venus. But Venus, but he also told her to not look in the box, but 
she did look at the box, but it so happened that Cupid saw her and made her not sleep anymore from the curse of the box. And then brought, she brought the box to Venus. And then, and then Venus made her immortal and then she married Cupid again. Okay. It's pretty good, Jubal. So that was Cupid and Psyche. From what book? Age of Fable. Age of Fable, good.